chance of taking the title race further. Nakamura! His first old firm goal! And typically, it's a beauty! Well, what a marvellous finish this is! Great first touch, he gets it out from his feet, and look at the bend and the dip on that one! Just look how much that moves away from McGregor. He thinks it's going to his left, but look at it on the end. It's a fantastic strike. Bang on the 20 minutes mark. And after all that pressure, it's paid off. Caldwell. McDonald. Fenegor of Hesselink. They've done it. Jan Fenegor of Hesselink. Answers a Celtic SOS. Jan Venegor Hesseling and onside, Scott McDonald! A startling start to this final Old Firm game as Scott McDonald puts Celtic in front with just over three minutes on the clock. McDonald. Oh, it's, it's in! He makes his mark at Celtic Park and this topsy-turvy tussle takes another twist. Celtic are in front again. And Maloney or Samaras! Celtic respond straight away! Nakamura has found the bottom corner, adding to his... Free kick connection. Samaras. Scott McDonald. Can he shake off Broadfoot? Yes, he can! An incredible goal! Scott McDonald makes the difference on Derby Day in Glasgow. Celtic have the lead at Ibrox. Rangers reeling. It was absolutely fantastic last week. But just look at this for a finish. Swung across there, and the other goal! Darren O'Dea, perhaps the most unlikely player on the pitch to score. He scores against Rangers for the first time in the cup final for the first time. He's now got the chance to make every Celtic fan roar. Celtic will win the Corporate Insurance Cup for 2009. Signed, sealed and delivered. McGinney. Against Alan McGregor, the goalkeeper got a hand to it. Benito McGinney drags Celtic back into the match. McGinney skipped away from Whitaker. McGinney, McDonald! Scott McDonald comes off the bench to seize the moment, and it's a magic moment for Celtic. has gone for it and it's took a little nick on the way I think Celtic make a storming start as they look to regain some pride Naylor's cross Fortuna and it's slipped past Alexander and Celtic are back in front in a pulsating old firm encounter the key corner and it comes Hooper and Celtic lead right at half time. It's an expert finish from Gary Hooper. And he sends Celtic Park wild with a can finish. He controlled it as well. And just slammed it into the. Foster. Gave it away to Ledley. Samaras is chasing this. And McGregor's come away. Giorgio Samaras scores for Celtic! Happy New Year to the men in hoops! They have the lead at Ibrox! Well, if anyone in green and white today deserves a goal, it's Giorgio Samaras. It is Samaras. It is 2-0. He is the man of the moment. What a way to start a year for Celtic! Well, goalkeepers just don't save.
everything. It's a terrific penalty. Because Alan McGregor goes early, he guesses right. Oh, the ball just hits the side net, the inside of the side net, and that's how good the strike is. Just opens his foot on it at the very last moment. Celtic have responded quite well to going behind. And then they could send this across for Cummins! They have equalised! Chris Cummins, on his own firm debut, has his say. Confronted by Naismith. Made room for the cross. Maybe he might just have taken that away from Samaras, but here's Wilson. Brown! Brilliant! The captain shows the way! The ten men of Celtic rally! It is 2-2! Well, again, you've got to hand it to Neil Lennon because he's pushed his fullbacks right forward now. Though, ...could make something happen now. Hooper. Skips past where? Gary Hooper! Born to score goals! Celtic strike first, and we have another early old firm goal to get us going. He's a Geary is to his left, if he can put him in here, and he's onside. He's a Geary. Hooper! Hooper. Commons. Chris Commons. 3 0. Celtic are loving it. Absolutely loving it. He scored on his Celtic debut. He scored on his old firm debut. And now on his home debut. Well, he did brilliantly to lose Bruguera, who's well positioned goal side. But I just wonder how much this moves. How much it moves in the air. Because it looked pretty easy for Alan McGregor. Let's go! Let's go! He's a Push that pass. Foster. Hooper let it go. And it's going to come here to Wilson to hit it. Brilliant clearance off the line, but he's going to have another go. And it's in this time! He's suddenly scoring loads of goals. Mark Wilson at the second time of asking. Celtic jump in front. Well, at long last, Izaguri gets down the outside of Foster, who's handled them really well tonight. But he gets the chance to throw an early with his left foot. Papas does well to match the run of Brown. Touching touch its way through, that might help Celtic, and it does! And the Apaka level turns through Joel Edley! The hero of midweek grabs his fifth of the season, and Celtic are back on terms! It's all down this left-hand side again, Liam. Not really getting to grips, throw ins too easy again, easy there. Little deflection, Samaras flicks on, but Ledley does brownly, Celtic right back in it. Great finish. No group. El Cadori. Brown again. Gary Hooper. Scores! A typically clinical finish from Gary Hooper. He scores on Derby Day again. It's 1 1. Oh, it's a special finish to beat Alan McGregor from that angle. Keith. El Cadore. Oh, it's a horrible clagger from Alan McGregor. He's let it slip behind him. Celtic have turned this all for match on its head. And El Cadore celebrates. And that could be ominous yet. Grew to take it. It's a goal. Celtic take the lead for Joe Ledley. He has grabbed hold of his derby and takes great pleasure in doing so. Well, Adam McCoy will be hugely disappointed that with so many players, goal side of the penalty spot, Ledley wins it, and he does. Corner. Celtic score! Charlie Mulgrew arrived at the right time. It's 1 0 to the 
champions! Oh, you've got to say, it's a terrific header from Johnny McGrew down into the ground. But the range of marking is woeful. They've got 11 players inside the box here, Rangers. The marking touch tight. Hooper. Can he pick out Commons? He can! It's Chris Commons! It's his first goal of the season! Talk about picking your moment! Celtic are sinking their teeth into Rangers now! Well, that's a finish that requires composure, and boy, did Chris Commons find it the vital moment from Joe Ledley, man. Commons has won it back off. Young McCabe, Samaras takes over. It's Hooper! with a guarantee of goals on Derby Day in Glasgow. Well, you know, th this has been the difference today. That's not bad. That's Gavis! Lee Gavis scores! And Celtic lead the Derby! The early goal, Rangers thread it! Spoke about at the start of the game. Rangers want to make sure they keep themselves in the in the, in the tie in inside ten minutes. It's a poor, poor defensive setup. Brown well, by Law. Brown keeps going. This common shoots. Oh! oh, that's stunning! Utterly stunning from Chris Commons. That is why Celtic need to keep him. What a goal that was! It's two nothing. Liam, we were speaking about before the game. I just cannot understand how this guy's not been in the team more often. You know, and the last wee period, he's come back into the side, and it's no coincidence, as far as I'm concerned, that Celtic have hit form. And look at that. That's out of nothing. Picks it up. Look here, Scott Brown getting on the second ball as well, keeping the ball in that area. Well played. One touch. No other thought in his mind other than having a shot on target. That is phenomenal strike. Roberts, again. Sinclair's corner. Red Valley makes the difference with a cracking header. Celtic strike first in the derby of derbies, and it had probably been coming. I think in his Aberdeen days. Beats on here for Dembele. First two ahead of Senderos. It is Musa Dembele. Griffiths, no worries, no problems, because Moussa Dembele has stepped forward and Celtic have a firm grip. Kennan, I'm not sure he was getting to that. Armstrong for Dembele. Sinclair not far away. Dembele finds Sinclair, who continues his scoring spree. Brendan Rodgers and Celtic are back in the comfort zone on the hour. Come up the hour, come up the man, Scott Sinclair. Roberts, McGregor, Lustig. Rangers exposed and struggling to get back here. Dembele! He's done it! Moussa Dembele! Takes his place in old firm hat trick history. There's only been one team in town today. Celtic. Sinclair. Here's Tierney. Is there another one? There might be for Armstrong. There is. Now that is really rubbing it in. Five. Rangers one. Great 
it here at the moment. That situation will change. One way or the other. Wallace just losing Griffiths. And it goes a loss for Celtic to Bibby. In the dying embers of the game. An eruption of green and white joy. Sinclair takes. Roberts, easily away from Mackay, and there's the switch, and there's the goal for Scott Sinclair, the champions have turned it around, and that will really, really hurt Rangers. It's for Lustig and giving him that diagonal ball, should have been a better delivery. Jason Holt. Miscued his clearance. Forrest. Armstrong! Smashed in by Stuart Armstrong. A goal that means so much in a game that means so much. Yeah, the early stages of the game, as I mentioned. Celtic utterly dominant. Going a long ball here. From Bennett. Supported here by McGregor. a race between the striker and the defender this is one big kick for Scott Sinclair he's done it just Celtic are in a rush to reach the final now and to send their old firm rivals packing see in Hampden last weekend an early chance to do the same again at Ibrox. He loves a goal in this game, Scott Sinclair. Here he comes. Celtic appear ready to rub it in. They've got Rangers where they want them again, thanks to another Scott Sinclair penalty. Armstrong releasing Griffiths. Sinclair waiting in the middle. Griffiths goes in alone, and that's why. Utterly ruthless, absolutely clinical from big part player this season to big part player. A stunning hit. Roberts feeding McGregor. Roberts, it's McGregor, took his time, but got what he wanted. He scored against Rangers last weekend, he's just done it again, and the champions are putting on a show. Griffiths floats it in, and it's found a way in, and Dedrick Boyata is having that one. It is 4-0 to Celtic. It is humiliating for Rangers. Lustig, to Celtic fancy a fifth. Mikael Lustig certainly does. What a tidy finish. A pulsating performance from Celtic. They have well and truly put Rangers in their place. Well, what a bit of quality this is from the right back. Could easily have laid it off. But Lustig's got the ability driving forward here on a loose ball.